the Bexa Boss Lady and all of the rage this Christmas season are these big giant ornament balls. I don't know if you've seen them, but they're all over Pinterest, social media, TikTok, whatever. And it seems to be there's one brand that sticks out and it's these holly balls. So they're holly balls. They look like giant exercise balls. I've never actually seen one in person. So we're gonna do all of this together for the first time. But I wanted to know, is it worth it to spend more money on the holly balls? By the way, I got these at belk.com, B-E-L-K. And I used a coupon code, so I was able to get them, I think for like 25 or 30% off on Black Friday. But they have different sizes and colors. Um, so I have a green, a bigger green one, a silver one, and then I got a red one. So I have three holly balls. And then I was thinking, mm, these are a little pricey, even with the discount. Let's see what other ones I can find. This one is from Amazon. This one is also from Amazon. So they're like two different brands that I found on Amazon. And this one I believe is from Walmart. I'll double check this one. So I'm pretty sure it's from Walmart. So I have these three different brands. Obviously you can see this one was $12.98. I think the Amazon one was 20 or 22. And then this Amazon one, I forget how much they were, but they were like different prices. And then the holly balls were like 30, 50, and 60. I don't know, they were they were really expensive. Let's see what the holly balls look like and we'll compare the other ones to them. I did, I have just like a, a air mattress inflator. I hope this works because I'm definitely not blowing, <laughs> blowing these up uh, with my mouth. Um, okay, let's try this one. So we'll just do the 30 inch vintage green holly ball. It's definitely exactly like an exercise ball. I used to own a gym, so I can assure you that this is what our little BOSU ball things were made of. Comes with a nice ornament cap. There is a measuring tape, a 3M sticker. I assume this goes on the top so you can hang them. Okay, the 3M sticker wire and such, an anchor, and a hook thing, a circle thing. And then there's directions. So let's read the directions. Oh, and there's stakes. So this way you can put them in the ground. Okay, it just says blow it up. That's in Spanish. All right, let's see if we can do this. I think the first thing you have to do is find the hole. Oh, there it is. Okay. smarter. Okay, now we're going to take the screw plug. Not sure I have it in all the way, but I also don't want to pop it, right? Now you put the lid on. So you're going to slide this through the top, twist it, and it pops like that. So that is what it looks like. Okay, we got one down. Let's do the smaller one. This one is the 18 inch silver. It has all the same gear, all the same accessories. I would have had this done almost two weeks ago, but I was hospitalized with sepsis and a kidney infection. And then I had to rest to heal from that. So it's been quite a December so far for me. It'll still look pretty for the rest of the month and for my birthday. I kind of think this should be all the way down, but I'm having a hard time. What I'll tell you is that this feels like, you know, quality material. This is very nice. It has their logo on it. It comes with all these extra accessories, so that's nice. So you can either hang them or attach them to the ground. I'm probably going to attach them to the ground. Okay, let's try this one. This is a 25 inch inflatable ornament ball from Amazon. This also comes with a gold cap. The cap is sticky. I'm not sure what that means. So it's like sticky on the inside. Kind of weird. It's like the gold melted. 
don't know if you can see that. Okay, it also comes with one of these things. This only comes with one stake. I don't know what these things, oh, this is a plug and a plug remover the hook sticker. This actually feels like a thicker plastic as well. Really, the test of time is going to be if, this, if these stand up to the elements, like snow, ice. I live in Ohio, so we get all that stuff here. The one thing I'll say is this cap doesn't have a special thing on the top to prevent it from coming up. That's the 25 inch. Another Amazon one, 21 inch. So this one's a little smaller. This thing you have to put together yourself. This is actually nice. It has similar pieces to the rest of them. This one has cord instead of wire. They also have the suction thing so that you can pin them to the ground with the anchors. I am having the hardest time with every single one of these. I just don't think I have hand strength to do this. Aha. And actually, this one feels more stable on the ball, on the ornament. Okay. My husband's going to come down and be like, what the hell are you doing? Alrighty, the last one, shiny green one, it looks iridescent. This says it's a blow up giant ornament. This is the Walmart one. This is the only one that has come with a repair patch. So this one, the top is actually just a piece of gold plastic. So this one doesn't even have the nice gold lid that the other ones do. One of these is not like the other. Holy moly, oh my God. <laughs> we didn't show you how much bigger this is. Uh, quite a bit different in size here. Nah, it's pretty cool. Let me show you how to hook the anchors because I'm not going to hang these in trees. I need to do this part differently. Before you put the lid on for the holly balls, you wanna attach this little anchor thing and then you tie these you like fishing wire, cut, measure, cut and tie them to here and then to the stake or anchor into your ground. And that's how you anchor the holly balls to the ground. What are my overall thoughts regarding holly ball and the others? Let me go outside, get them all blown up, try to <laughs> hook them up outside and then I'll give you the full recap of which one I prefer. It's a lot colder today and so far all of the balls are still inflated and even this giant one you can see the ones with the holly ball have the actual holly ball logo on there and then these are the amazon ones i will say this one is probably the one I'm least impressed with. It just didn't come with enough hooks. The three holly balls are very nice. It's the next day. I just went out to check on my big balls. It was cold overnight. It's rainy. They are all still inflated. So that is a very good sign. I will say that one of the balls is definitely the lesser quality of them. And I'm going to go back and I'll put which one is which in the description of this video. I'll also put the links of what I actually got and I'll try to find the best prices for the holly balls for you too. The holly balls are definitely the best quality. They have the thickest rubber on the balls. They have the nicest cap to them. They come with better stakes than the other, uh, the other ones. But if you're on a budget and you need something cute or you just want a little pop of Christmas or the holidays in your outside area, I don't think that there's any harm in getting the other ones. The problem with the less expensive ones, they will last less seasons. In the next couple years, they might be obsolete anyway and no one will be using them anymore, so who knows. 
But if you can get a Holly Ball, you can afford it and you can get it on sale, that is the one that I would recommend. However, there are alternative options. I don't hate the giant Walmart inflatable one, to be quite honest. It came with really good ties, actually because it's so big and the stakes on that one were really kind of crappy. I actually tied it to the trees and the shrubs outside and then I had one that I attached to the bottom into the ground. We'll see how they all last over the season. I'm really hoping that they will be able to be used year after year. I believe you just deflate them, fold them up, and I save the boxes for them. That way I can, I can reuse them year after year. If you like my content or you have any ideas for things you want me to try, post it in the comments below. Don't forget to hit subscribe and I hope you're enjoying my new content. I will see you next time. Thank you everyone. Bye-bye.